Hey yo, what is going on? Enjoy family. All right, so I'm actually about to head out to run some errands before work, but I had to do a follow up video so that when you guys experience this, you won't be like, oh, she didn't tell me this. Oh, I don't want to do this anymore. I had to do a follow up. Some of us have been trying to walk with God for a long time, but what ends up happening is that the devil literally comes in and tries to destroy our potential, destroy our determination and our ambition to go back there. The enemy likes to offer something I like to call pushback or spiritual warfare starts to happen. This is what this is what it looks like. So as soon as you say yes to God, now God is fighting for you in every single battle. However, the enemy realizes that as soon as you say yes to him, that he has lost another soul to hell. Somebody else is on a winning team. And that means you are now a potential candidate from getting those people who are under the trap of the enemy out and recruiting them to, with God, to go with God too. That's the only reason why he does it. However, it is so serious to him that your spiritual warfare is going to seem like somebody is just out for you. I mean, you're not going to see anybody around physically. And sometimes it may come to that, but you're not going to see anybody around physically trying to attack you. But it's going to be like something always in the spirit, like in, in the dark realm is trying to get you. And you're going to be like, what the heck? But in the end, y'all, y'all have to realize, and this is something that I, I hope you take dear to heart, not only with this spiritual um um following god and everything but also with just things in life if it's something worth valuable if it's something of value go for it no matter how much pushback you're receiving that's what the enemy wants as soon as we say yes to god he starts offering all these attacks what he wants us to say never mind i don't want to do it no more this is too hard but you have to understand that the value that's on the other side, what God can give you, what God can show you, everything that he has, the fact that he's the creator and he knows all things and he knows the best plan for your life is way more valuable, way more valuable than what the enemy is trying to give you or offer you. So consider the pushback, mm, you can consider it a little blessing. I guess you can consider it a blessing because now you know that, wow, the devil is really mad and God is really fighting on my side. All I ask is that you don't let the enemy win. God is on your side. He's going to win every time. The only reason that it seems like the enemy is winning is when we start to give up. And that we can't do. So yes, this day, if you are going to say yes to God, you're going to seek God, you're going to submit to him. Understand that there will be pushback, but understand what God has is far, God has is far more valuable, far more valuable what the enemy is trying to push or has to offer. Far more valuable. And know, just like I said in the previous video, and know that as soon as it starts happening, God is already working the things in you that you need in order to conquer this pushback the enemy is trying to give. It will not prevail, but it's up to us. It's up to us to keep that straight. Y'all gonna go because people started to look at me like, who is she talking to? I'm talking to y'all, but let's get it. Just, <laughs> just know that god is already working things in us as soon as we start seeking him to prepare us for battle he's not gonna let us lose it's up to us to stay on the winning team and not let their pushback scare us all right guys i hope you enjoyed this video share this with somebody who gets scared or even with yourself when you get frightened and you see like i'm trying to go towards god but something always holding me back know this is what's happening but know that this is what you're supposed to do to conquer it I hope you guys live and enjoy the Lord and enjoy it for the rest of this weekend. I will see you guys soon. Bye.